a song of ascents, a prayer of St. G. I rejoiced when I heard them say, let us go up to the house of the Lord, to the house of Yahweh we go. And now our feet are standing there, our peace, Jerusalem. Then I declare your praises and rejoice in your salvation. Hear the word of the Lord, all you people. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving. Our trouble faded become our readiness to go through your gates, before your sacred walls, your palaces. You, the object of our desire, and this, your dwelling place. Here we enter, here we abide forever. Nothing separates us from it but the river of death crossing at your permission. The sun of righteousness draws near, filling all spaces, the ark of Noah resting here, whose son you are. At rest we have a continuance here, the only floodwaters of grace, mercy, and love. Who entered but pure and holy persons, and how? By blood and by the linen of your righteousness. No ancient glories here, but all new magnificence, the maker of heaven and earth, and eternal peace abiding with his people. How remote we were, but now drawn very near. All festivals are new, all songs unending, and your everlasting love rests upon our souls. We have new eyes, all things human now perfected. Each day we approach, and these without end, nor any margins between. At times we think to call back to our fellows and tell them all that is, but they are not there, the gulf too great. The time is now, for somehow they do not see you, hear you, love you. Nor did we, but the Lord himself visited us each with your salvation. This is why we sing and cannot stop, and each moment is greater than the accumulation of our joys there in the lower world. He which sought to conquer us was conquered, not by power, not by might, but by your spirit, Lord. It was I in the byways, unwelcome by the world, but in your house a wedding feast, and I with proper linen given me. I was glad when they said to me, come up to the house of the Lord. And many years I did not hear, but you were patient. And while I tore myself apart, you were restoring me. Whither the tribes go up, the tribes of the Lord, unto your testimony. For there are thrones set up, the thrones of the house of David, the beloved. For he and we are loved by you, thus do we love, thus do we enter. We have only to say, Jesus is Lord, and believe. But how shall we believe? There are some you see eternally, and many to perish unseen, for your holiness will not abide them. And thus in your mind from everlasting, we always were with you, and they were not. We cannot say why, only that the Lord will do of your good pleasure, so to glorify yourself, and sovereignly. For you are king, and we have no say, yet are not trampled under, but lifted up, not ciphers, but children, the adopted of the Father of love, and brother to the Son, and spirit to the Spirit. <laughs>